Hey guys, what is up? Today I'm going to be giving you a short tutorial on how to fix uh, NVIDIA highlights. So there can be a lot of issues with this. There can be issues where um, it's recording your second monitor, not your primary monitor. Uh, there can be issues where it's not recording clips at all. Um, there can be a lot of issues with it. So um, the first thing that you're going to want to do is open up a uh, GeForce experience. And um, you're going to go to the settings cog up here. And you need to make sure that in-game overlay is turned on. So if this isn't turned on, that's going to be your first problem. Next thing uh, that you're going to want to do is go into settings. And another way to get to this is once you have that on, you can press Alt and Z. And you can go to settings. And you can go to uh, recordings. Now, uh, the temporary file directory, if you have a space in your username, you're going to want to go ahead and click here and then keep pressing this up arrow and then reselect the file. So just go all the way through and reselect the uh, app data loca, local temp uh, file there. Another thing is, um, as you can see, there's a space in my username. And so sometimes it's going to have a malfunction here and it's going to say valued. And it's going to be in all caps and then it's going to be like a squiggly line and then one. You need to give it the correct file path. So you need to actually go here, go ahead and press the up button and uh, select the right folder where you want it to go. So in addition to that, you're going to need to go into your highlights and um, you might, there could be a problem where you don't see the game. If that's happening, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to enable it in game. So I'll show you how to do that in a second. Um, so if you don't see this, that could also be a problem. Um, and then obviously you have to change uh, your uh, temporary file path as well here. So you're going to want to go back and fix that. Make sure this is you know, an area where uh, you selected the path yourself by clicking up, 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 and going back and selecting exactly where you want to put it. So, yeah, the file path could be a problem. Uh, make sure this is enabled, obviously. Now, uh, let's say it's not recording. Uh, so that, that should fix the issue where it's not recording at all. Um, also, you should go into your game, and when you're in your game, you're going to want to make sure to go into options, go into graphics, and scroll on down to NVIDIA highlights and make sure that's enabled as well in the game. So um, once you have that enabled, let's say you start recording some clips. Um, it does have a, a double kill option um, right here. So let's say you don't see this menu at all. If you don't see this, that's a problem. After you enable it in game and you've enabled uh, in GeForce Experience, you've ena enabled the in-game overlay, um, what you're gonna wanna do is restart your computer and then you should see this menu. Uh, you might have to open the game first, but you should see this. So if we scroll down the list, uh, it says double kill is something that it will record, but it doesn't really record double kills. So um, a way to possibly fix this would be turn it off and on, but I, I think it's just a bug and it just doesn't record double kills. It does record fury kills and a bunch of the other ones, which is a good thing. Uh, but some things that it says it records, it just doesn't record. So turning it off and on might fix it, it might not. So let's say that uh, you do have NVIDIA highlights enabled, but it's recording the wrong monitor. Well, this is also another bug. Um, so it's kind of funny how buggy the NVIDIA highlights and everything is. But um, the way that you can fix that is you're going to want to go into NVIDIA control panel. And once you uh, open up your NVIDIA control panel, you click on set up multiple displays. Now, if I right click on this monitor here, I see it says make primary. What you're going to have to do if your this monitor is set as your primary monitor here, um, but it's still recording the second monitor, you're going to need to right click on your secondary monitor, make it primary, and then uh, go ahead and click apply and everything and then click accept. Um, but then what you're going to do is you're going to reset your main monitor back to your primary monitor. And after that, it should fix the issue and it should start recording the correct monitor. So if you have any comments or questions or issues, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. Uh, I hope this video helped you. I know it was short, um, but yeah, um, I hope it helps. Thanks for watching and have a good day.